friends, thanks for checking out this week in review. So I just spent nine hours in a car on Friday, coming back from Memphis, Tennessee with Brian and Jenny Lore and five of our students from Neighborhood Church. We spent the whole week in uh, Memphis, Tennessee at Big Hatchie Youth Camp, which was super, super exciting. It was exhausting, but exciting. We, we probably woke up every morning at seven and didn't go to bed until midnight or one o'clock. So it was Woo, extremely, I know, <laughs> camp life, right? But Pastor Dave led the worship services in the evening through the Sermon on the Mount, um, the Beatitudes Manly, and we the title of the week was the Upside Down Kingdom. And in the mornings, Pastor Dave and Rivers, they got to do different classes going through the Sermon on the Mount, and I got to help teach one of those as well, which was super exciting. And the last day of camp, I found out that two kids that were in my group um, decided to give their lives to Jesus, which is super, super exciting. And I'm, I'm excited to follow up with Shane um, at Beaver Baptist in Tennessee just to see how those kids are doing. So awesome. that was my last week. Yeah, and for me, I was here in Kansas City in our home, uh, and it was just a work week. But one exciting thing that happened for me, a little bit of a random story, but we've been trying to let my cat go outside into this patio courtyard area that we have that's surrounded by a fence. And as I've been doing that, my cat has decided that it wants to jump the fence and always into my one neighbor's yard. So the cool thing is though, is this is a neighbor that we have just not connected yeah. with. She's in her 20s um, and we kind of hoped that there would be something there, but our conversations have been short, awkward. Um, they've just never led anywhere. Inviting her has, so things just has kind of come up mm -hmm. null. But last week I got to have three conversations with her because of my crazy cat. And those conversations- right That's what I keep looking at. <laughs> Wheels, you'll see them someday. And because of that, our conversations, I mean, had to do with like my cat being in our yard, but they just have evolved until the last conversation was more about personal life. And it was natural and a fun conversation. Mm -hmm. And so just continue to pray with us that this opportunity that I thought was a closed door would slowly become more open and, and we sure. would get to know her even more. Awesome. And so this week what we have going on is I'm preparing to preach on Sunday going to be preaching at neighborhood church closing mm -hmm. up Matthew chapter 14 also preparing a whole bunch of stuff for sports camp I'm organizing and coordinating the rally times like all the speakers and the fun stuff that goes and happens there so we're super excited because we have maybe 150 kids we have 40 different adults from Memphis from Atlanta mm -hmm. from Oklahoma City and other places that are coming to help out at sports camp so we're still preparing things like that and then next Monday we are prepping for our courtyard cookout number two too. Mm -hmm. So praying that more neighbors would come mm -hmm. out and um, we'd be able to build more relationships with them. So that's what's happening this week in review. Thanks yep. for checking it out. Thanks so much. Talk to you soon. And we'll see you later. Hey friends, thanks for watching our video. Before you go jump into some other videos on the interweb, we wanna let you know that everything we do with Neighborhood Church and in our community, um, from preaching to planning parties, to scheduling, leading discipleship, all these different kind of things, everything that we do is supported by individuals like you. And so Leah and I wanna invite you to prayerfully consider joining our team and financially partnering with us. Our heart is to spread the kingdom of God, to plant neighborhood-centric churches all across Kansas City. And this month, the month of June, we're praying and asking God for $1,000 additional in monthly support from individuals like you. So if you're interested in joining our team or financially giving, you can do that at www.ericandleah.com forward slash support us. Well, be sure to check in, watch some more videos, get our updates. We love you and we're thankful for your support. Grace and peace.